Good afternoon, LHS. I'm Darren. And I'm Devin. Today's Tuesday, September 19th. Here is WLHS reporter Leah bringing you the two-day forecast. Good afternoon, LHS. I'm reporter Leah with the two-day forecast. Tomorrow, Wednesday, is going to be high of 83 and a low of 62, and it's going to be sunny. And Thursday, it's going to be high of 83 and a low of 60, and sunny also. Have a great day. Thanks, Leah. Looks like it's going to be dumb warm, so go outside, walk. Ride bike, ride scooter, ride what you want to ride. Just be productive. Facts. Yo, Devin, did you hear how much money we raised on that dress down day on Friday? I heard it was about 1500 It was a little over that, and all of that money goes towards the relief efforts for Hurricanes Harvey and Irma. So great job, guys. Great job. Do you want to be a more active member of your school? Do you want to help with fun events, plans, and activities throughout the school year? Well, you're in luck because Student Council is always looking for more members to join. And if you're interested, talk to Mr. Seifert in room L201. The class of 2019 is selling subs and soup. See any junior or Mrs. Brown Kohler to order. Who doesn't love subs and soup? I know I do. And you're supporting their class, so go out there and buy some. Try High Y is sponsoring a movie night September 22nd. The doors open at 6.30 p.m. and the movie, Beauty and the Beast, will start at 7. You gotta be a Disney fan. You gotta be a Disney fan. Go watch the movie. Admission is free, but donations for the Lebanon and Rescue Mission will be accepted. There will also be a concession stand selling popcorn and drinks, and I know everyone loves food. It doesn't get much better than that. It really doesn't. Save the date! The homecoming dance is coming up. Saturday, October 7th from 7 to 10 p.m. in the LHS atrium, and the theme is Midnight in the Secret Garden. Doesn't that just sound enchanting? Tickets go on sale starting Thursday, September 28th, after school in the cafeteria, and the tickets are only $10. The last day to buy tickets is Wednesday, October 4th. Only seniors are permitted to bring a guest and are required to fill out and sign the form located in the high school office or in room A247. The completed form must be returned to school the day of your purchase, and guests will be required to provide identifications prior to admission. Dude, it's homecoming. You cannot miss this. You can't. You only get four chances, and for seniors, this is your last chance, so be there. The Future Business Leaders of America, or FBLA Club, is a really cool organization. Our WLHS reporters Nikisha and Alishka got a closer look at what they do there. Here's Alishka Perez interviewing the advisor of FBLA, Mrs. Hatos. I've been the advisor for FBLA since the fall of 2009. So this is my start of my eighth year doing FBLA. What is FBLA about? FBLA is about encouraging young people to learn leadership skills and to learn about the American free enterprise system through attending conferences, leadership events, and competing against other students in business-related topics. What are the benefits of joining FBLA? Benefits of joining FBLA? Well, um, as I said, we attend a lot of field trips, uh, leadership conferences. Some of them are overnight stays, some of them are day stays. Um, we also operate the school store, which a lot of students like to work at and buy candy from. Um, and we also help with other school-related activities. Sign up. Signing up is very easy. Just stop by my room in 228. I have applications, just looking for some demographic information, and um, that's all there is to it. Very easy. Thank you. You're very welcome. Here's WHS member Nikisha interviewing two members of FBLA. Hi, I'm Nikisha from WLHS, and I'm interviewing Emily Shee from FBLA. So why did you sign up for FBLA? I signed up for FBLA because I was really into business for a while and FBLA related to that. And I really like associating with my fellow classmates. Do you enjoy being in FBLA? I do because we do fun things like leadership conference meeting and those are 
not always interesting, but they're always fun to go to. Thank you for interviewing me. Hi, I'm Keisha from WHS, and I'm interviewing Anna from FBA. So why did you sign up for FBA? I signed up for FBLA because I think it shows like good leadership skills. If you're like into business and all that, it shows you like how to handle things on your own. And like it's good if you want a business career and it's just like fun, fun people. And there's like many activities and things you can do. School store, for example. So yeah, it's just a nice club to be in. You like being in FBLA? Yeah, I really do. Like the people there, everything is nice, everything's fun. If you're interested in joining the FBLA club, please see Mrs. Hatos in room N228. Thank you, ladies. If you're interested in signing up for FBLA, see Mrs. Hatos in room N228. There will be a key club meeting this Friday during homeroom in Mrs. Johnston's room, G258. There will also be a Tri High Y meeting this Friday during homeroom in Mrs. Clark's room, L123. Picture day is coming up on Wednesday, September 27th. See your homeroom teacher for an order form and make sure you dress up real nice like. Dress appropriate. It's your last picture. Possibly. Congratulations to the girls volleyball team on their third place finish this weekend at the annual Cedar Classic Tournament. There is a boys varsity soccer game against Hempfield at 4 p.m. tomorrow and JV plays at 5.45 p.m. Tomorrow, there is also a girls' varsity tennis match against McCassidy at 4 o'clock p.m. I know you can't go out and support all of them, but you got to show up to at least one of these games. And give your all in your spirit. If you have any suggestions or announcements that you would like to see in our broadcast, please contact a member for more information. Have, have a, a great, great day, day Lebanon High! high.